Yes, I think the uh, the business partnership for the police, which is the current program for involving the private sector in policing, has been something of a disaster, and mainly because it's been one of the most unbusinesslike uh, business uh, relationships I've ever uh, run across. Um, it's one of those where even the government's own procurement guidelines, which means you should be starting off with a proper outline business case, you probably need to have some consultants uh, from the start advising you how to actually do that. Uh, unfortunately, we moved straight to an OGU notice, which was so wide, uh, it included the uh, clear uh, statements that uh, patrolling our streets, uh, detective uh, work could be included in the bid uh, because the OGU notice was so wide and because there wasn't an outline business case suggesting otherwise, then clearly the fears and concerns of all uh, were actually raised. Uh, so far, I've still to see any evidence as to uh, a, a exactly what uh, the uh, we want at the police authority, exactly which areas we do want to uh, consider partnership for, and I've yet to see any evidence as to why we will save any money uh, in that particular area. I think the whole thing is now so discredited, we effectively need to scrap it. Uh, the Home Affairs Select Committee cross party has decided to uh, condemn it. Uh, the Surrey Police Authority, where you not find a Labour politician in sight and uh, probably even slightly more business experience on Surrey Police Authority than there is on the West Midlands Police Authority and even on West Midlands Police Authority, it was the people who have actually been involved in business partnerships that were the biggest critics, including the representatives of business, particularly uh, condemned the proposals in relation to uh, bringing in the consultants at such a late stage and giving them a performance bonus to actually get a signature on the contract. As someone who has been in charge of partnerships before, I chaired a, a joint uh, partnership uh, board with Enterprise at Wolverhampton Council, I chaired the Lyft project board for the health service, I chaired a PFI project board for the Wentzfield Leisure Centre. I am clearly of the opinion that business has a big part to play, but it needs to be done on a business, proper business one, and it also needs to be ensured exactly what it's going to cover. And what it shouldn't cover is any services where core policing services, i.e. those that require professional policing powers to be used and the people that immediately support them, people do need to have confidence that those powers are being exercised on behalf of the whole of the community, everyone equal under the law, and we need to be assured that it is not being driven by the needs of shareholders and making a profit. Okay, well, thank you very much.